Hey Clashers welcome back. I hope you all are having good clash with your opponents. Today in this video, I will be explaining you all, how you can use Zap with Dragons. This is one of the best attack strategy at, Town Hall 11, to triple many bases easily. So let's begin the video. Youngs on the man get the cash when I can Got a pipe for the low in the bag and I'm saying some dope I shout it Come and die for me shoot them all Let's have a look at the army composition to be used for the Zap Dragons. It consists of 6 loons, 7 dragons, 1 lava, 1 electro dragon, 1 ice golem, 4 super goblins, 1 minion, and 1 archer. In spells, you will be using 6 zap, 3 earthquake, and 1 healing spell. In clan castle, you will be using 7 loons, 1 rage spell, and a stone slammer. If you don't have max level heroes, still you can easily triple any town hall 11 base, with this strategy. Disclaimer. In this video all the attacks are been done 100 plus times on a single base. Here you will only see bases getting triple. This video is just to teach you, how not to triple all the bases. So let's jump on to our first attack. Here, the two center air defenses are close to each other. So, I took them down with a 2 zap plus 1 quake combination. Then both the air defense was taken down in the same way. Then on the right side, I used the Electro Dragon to clear some buildings. On the left side, I used the Super Goblins to take down the storage, so that the hero should go on to right side. Then, I dropped the Ice Golem with a, King and Queen. Here, I have dropped the Stone Slammer on the left side. So, he can take down the left Inferno. Then, I dropped all the dragons, with the Lava Hound and, the rest of the loons following the Warden. Here, I have used early Warden ability because the artillery was going to hit the dragons. You can use the ability later also. I have used the Rage spell here, to give a boost to the army, to clear the defense buildings faster. Now, as the left side Inferno Tower is taken down, all the dragons will go towards the right side. I have used the heal spell here, because the dragons were on low health and, artillery was going to hit. So, as you all can see, how powerful this army is, half the army is still alive. Let's have a look at our second attack. So, this base is looking little tough, right? Here, I have made some changes in the army. I have used, the super wall breaker to open the left wall, and let the heroes take down the left air defense. And in spell, I have removed healing spell, and used two more zap to take down the sweeper. Let's have a look at our attack. Here, I have taken down the air defense with the 2 zap plus 1 quake combination. Here, I have used the quake in such a way that it gives damage to both, air defense, and the sweeper too. And for the last air defense, I have used the same 2 zap plus 1 quake. And the last 2 zap, I have used to take down the sweeper, as I have given some damage with the quake. Now, I have used one dragon to take down the right army camp. And I have dropped the rest of the army, to let them get into the core, 
with an early warden ability as, three expos were giving high damage to the dragons. I have used the rage spell here, to give them a power boost, and to clear the buildings faster. Before going ahead, drop a like if you find this video helpful. I have added few more replays, so you can have a good idea of how powerful this army is. When you want to get off the darkest ground The gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You 
Come in my money flip like one, two, three Fly around the world down in New Delhi Yeah, while all of a sudden they wanna act like we friends Probably cause you see me riding in a brand new Benz Like Zoom, Shinkansen, down in Tokyo I'm tired of hearing that you missed the old Hugo I'm coming to your city in a UFO If you ain't getting litty G